All right, so we are way out, uh, way up the river. Uh, Koi and I floated down through here, I guess two years ago and found some pig signs. So we're gonna go up here and just poke around, see if we can find any pigs. Got the fishing poles along, got Liz to look for some mushrooms. So we're just gonna basically put around and explore. No real plan other than to have a good time. Y'all ready? Uh-huh. high. Yeah, we just got a bunch of rain. The river's kind of up a little bit, so. Well, yeah, I got to sit, buddy. I got all of our jackets and stuff here. All right, Finn, come back here and get where you're supposed to get. up to this big sandbar here and maybe there's a um, that train trestle the uh, there should be an old railroad bed we could walk for a ways and just check it out we'll pull up right down here Put it over, flip it, make it make an X like that, mm -hmm. and then go around one more time. And then you can, when we jump off, you can grab, grab that tied up. Okay. So, look, so don't don't tie a double knot. So just come around here and tie a knot around just right here, and then. When you get ready to undo it, all you gotta do is pull this. Okay. And you put that tail through there, and it's good to go. Not gonna come undone with this current? Oh man, I hope not. Well, yeah, me too. So dirty on the back, you can't see it. Yeah, but I think I, I think they're turkey towels. You can't see the spores on I mean the pores on the back though. What's got in there? Oh yeah. Yeah. I don't but they're not like they're more smooth on the back instead of all the little pores though. I got a bunch of them. Oh. From back there. What? I don't know. I think I'd just look at the book. Take them back and see. Well, those, I'm not sure what those are. 
I have a book, but I didn't see those in. I didn't see those in the book. There goes the fishing game. What those? What's yeah. the back look like? Mm. Elegant turkey tail? I don't know. We're amateur mycologists. <laughs> Alright, let's see what else we can find. Let me get the gun. Look here. Pretty cool bark, isn't it? This is a good one. What is it? Where? What is it? In the tree stand. Sure enough. So this is a good tree to know down here. Got any idea? You got any idea what this is? Paper. This is this is river birch. Very good for a fire starter. Here's some more mushrooms back here. Ah, Y'all are smoking me out here. <coughs> All right, let's go. Take your fire. Get ready to fire. You want to put that out? This is all tore up right here, Finn. Mm -hmm. What it, this is all this is all hog sign right here. It's all old. But that's good. There's hogs here. Mm -hmm. What you got there? Is this purslane? Purslane? No. That's uh hey, this is not the clean. This is? Yeah. Does it look like, like the vine, honey? Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know why I bring a gun. Why? Why do you think? I don't know. <laughs> Dad. Dad. This fresh? Does it look fresh? Yeah. So look, you see how it's, you see how the, it's got rain spatter all over it? Yeah. So look close, so you can tell. You can tell that that was from before the rain, from all the rain spatter. If it was fresh, see, it'd look more like that. Okay. Here. It's so dirty on the back, you can't see. Oh, Mom, does that look like uncooked steak? It doesn't look like steak to me. No, it doesn't. Some foragers make a tasty vegan beef jerky from this fungus. It doesn't sound very good to me. <laughs> Dad, are you ready to go? Well, we got to figure out where we're going to go next. You get your map that you're looking at. I need to be telling people where you're going. <laughs> Everybody will figure out where there's no hogs. <laughs> Did you do that? No. Someone got a couple. You didn't ice water. do that. No. Let me see. Uh, really? No, I didn't do it. <laughs> Koi, did you do it? No. Look, Koi's got the face too. Maybe it was him. I didn't do it. Who did it? Someone. I didn't do it. All right. Or maybe it wasn't ice. Maybe Dad spilled coffee on the floor and left it because it wouldn't be the first time that he's done it. Wasn't me. Koi, quit putting water in the boat. All right, I'll be back in a little bit. Okie dokie, tie us up. So Liz, stay back at the boat with the other two boys. And uh, I'm just going to make a quick loop through here. See if I see any sign. There's an old, 
there's old rootings around here everywhere. I mean, this whole place is tore up. This is the first fresh sign I've seen. This was, well, it rained last night, so this is today. actually quite a bit of fresh sign in here and I don't see any other boot tracks so I'm I'm thinking those pigs are somewhere relatively close by but they could be bedded and you'd have to step on them you'd have to darn near step on them if they're bedded to find them What are you doing? Hiding from the kids. <laughs> I don't know where I'm, I'm being home for me. I think I'm lost. <laughs> There's a nice little spot. There's a lot of birds out here. I <sighs> snuck over here and sat down. We had, we were walking. We found one of those big old things of mushrooms hanging from a tree. Yeah, I, saw, I think I saw that. Brown ones in, in there. And when I was looking at that, that had a poo emergency. So we had to run back <laughs> the toilet paper. <laughs> that was a good thing you brought some. Well, there's some fresh hog sign down there, but I didn't see any hogs. No. There's, this whole place is tore up. All this. I don't know. I was looking. Yeah. That's a good place, Dad. You like that spot? Yeah. All right. We'll pull up there. I take my life jacket off. What kind of tracks are those? What do you think? Look here. Look here. How many toes do they have? How many toes do they have? Five. Five toes? It's an otter. Oh, good job, buddy. It is an otter. plan was to have a catch fish and have a shore lunch, but we haven't caught any fish. So. Good thing I brought the leftover steak. What'd you find? Somebody's beanie weenie can. Man, that's a that's a treasure. Let's see what you got here. Got some heron tracks. Dad, can you eat this stuff right here? Well, you probably could, but let's see. Yeah. Don't get water down inside your boot, Finn. You're getting close to the top. He's gonna fill his boot up with water. Bite of that apple. Okay. It's really good apple. That's mine. Mm -hmm. <sighs> you shouldn't. These apples are very expensive. It costs at. Um, can you get that? At, 
Publix. I paid 16 bucks for those apples on the table. For how many apples? I don't know. A lot. Wish I would have got that face. Let's do that face again. I paid $16 for those apples. <laughs> Man, mom should have had that on <laughs> dad. What well, what did he do? He said, for how many apples? <laughs> well, a pretty damn expensive apple. Yeah, they were. They were like two something a pound. We got just a couple more bins and then we're gonna hook hang a left into a sloop and we gotta go up that sloop. We'll get up there where we where I saw all those bass the other day. Hey, I want another apple. You can wait. You're you'll be fine for now. Hey, right. I only got you, one apple. Well you should save that last apple for the trip back. Because that's all there is left. A steak. And some apples. Sorry about this worm. Oh my god, I think it did. Did I not get tight enough? Y'all seeing fish yet? Yeah, I'll see. There's a big one right there. Big fish? Yeah. Ben, you can't fish as we're going through here, buddy. You'll get all tangled up. You'll have to wait till we stop. Gotta learn to cast in these little tight spots, buddy. You get it thrown out there, Coy, maybe behind the boat. Wait, 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 wait. Wait till it goes Damn. down. Now, go, 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 go Ben. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Woo, you got a bass. Keep going. Woo! <laughs> ben. <laughs> Woohoo! Good job, buddy. <laughs> All right. Sweet. Get, get a picture. Come oh, I'm right in there. Hold him out like this. So he's real close to the camera. There you go. That's the same kind of. That's the same kind of we've caught last night. Hold his tail up. Like no, put your fingers underneath. Put your hand on, underneath. There you go. Now hold him way out like this. <laughs> he looks like one of those basking sharks. You keeping it? Yeah. All right, dinner. Finn has caught us some dinner. I'm trying to video and we're all over the place. Which one? Right in there. Don't even there. Woohoo! You'll fill up. Give him five. All right, Coy, you're next, buddy. Ooh, Finn's got a big one. He's got a log. Oh, hmm. He's got a log, sir. <laughs> Get it? Another hook. Man, Ben. Woo, Benny. Whoa. Man. Another one. Can I reach in there and grab him? Put your finger oh, up his mouth. There's the worm. So stick your thumb in his mouth. There you go. Let him go. There's the worm. Yeah. Let me see, Ben. Benny, Benny, let me see. Good job, buddy. Hope it doesn't, this one doesn't pop out. Man, Ben's getting us dinner. Now the fish has a friend. This is what happens when a seven year old sees a school of fish. Seven, 
Oh, excuse me, eight year old. Almost nine. That's the dorsal. What about what about this fin? I forgot what that one's called. Those are pectoral fins. What do you think they're used for? Why would they why would they have these here? To go backwards? They can go backwards, yep. Helps keep them stabilized, helps them steer. So there's one cool thing about fish that we don't have. You see this line right here? That yeah, right there, all fish have that's called a lateral line. You know how I was telling you guys to be quiet and don't stomp around on the boat yesterday? That's because, hey, that's because this line right here, that's a sensory organ, like our eyes and our ears and our nose, that we, we sense and, and, our, and our touch, our skin. So fish can feel what's around them. They can feel the vibration. So even when it's dark or the water's muddy, they can feel other fish around them and they can feel vibration like if you step on the boat they can feel that that's called row so was this a is this a male or a female 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 Is that good? It's good. You like it? Go a piece of fish, Kate, if you want some. I've already eaten today. I just ate at Waha. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this video. If you want to see more hunting and fishing adventures with the Hayes boys, be sure to subscribe to the channel. We're putting out a new video every Thursday, so we'll see you on the next adventure. Did he shoot one? Oh, my God.